Hello, my name is Adak Abate. I'm the leader for the Drought Tolerant Maze for Africa or DTMA project, led by the International Center for Maize and Wheat Improvement or CIMIT, in close, close collaboration with the International Institute of Tropical Agriculture as well as national programs in 13 sub-Saharan Africa countries. I'm an agricultural scientist originally from Ethiopia and have worked with smallholder farmers and national research uh, systems for more than 30 years now. Maize is life for more than 300 million people in sub-Saharan Africa. However, its production is constrained by many factors. Moisture stress or drought comes on top of the list. Occasional and frequent droughts cause 10 to 50 percent yield loss each year in sub-Saharan Africa. Severe drought causes total crop failure. And failed crop means a disaster to households and food security in Africa. For example, during the 2011 drought in the Horn of Africa, some 12.5 million people went hungry. DTMA was launched in 2006 to mitigate drought and other constraint problems associated with maize production in sub-Saharan Africa. The project has made significant progress since then. Based on seed production figures, in recent years, an estimated 2 million people are already using drought-tolerant maize varieties developed under DTMA in sub-Saharan Africa. We strive to reach more and more farmers in the coming years. We want to redouble our efforts to raise awareness among farmers themselves, local governments, national governments, local, regional and international maize seed producing companies in Africa. I would like to thank you and all the foundations and development agencies that have generously supported our work. It is my hope that you all would help us by spreading the good news about drought tolerant maize in Africa. I thank you all. The International Maize and Wheat Improvement Centre aims to sustainably increase the productivity of maize and wheat systems to ensure global food security and reduce poverty.